Tonight, a Help Me Hank scam alert reveals why children are being targeted by identity thieves. In fact, children are 35 times more likely to become victims of that crime than adults. Pretty frightening yeah, when you think about it. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester looks at why children are at risk, and sometimes the thief is someone you know. Yeah, which is really scary. You're talking about a family member, possibly a cousin or an uncle, somebody that needs a little bit of cash. Tonight, how to protect your children and yourself. That's pretty scary. Yeah, that's pretty scary. Children being targeted, parents on edge. I want my children to have every opportunity and not to be worried when they turn 18 of what this means for a college admissions, for a job, for everything, for credit. Experts say children are prime targets for identity thieves. Creditors are more likely to loan money to people who don't have a history of bad credit. Um, faulty credit. Dr. Kate Williams is the director of research at consumeraffairs.com. She says that's why identity thieves love a child's clean credit report. And thieves know most parents aren't watching those credit reports, so their fraud can go on for years. Williams heard one incredible story. That talks about an 18 year old girl who had one and a half million dollars in debt to her name that had accumulated over 15 or more years. More disturbing, research shows an alarming 27% of identity theft victims had a personal relationship with the predator. These are the people you're supposed to be able to trust the most with your information, and, and there's a certain level of betrayal, obviously. In your family, you need to watch out for relatives who might be having money troubles, a gambling problem, addiction, or anyone who's asked for too much personal information. Williams says the problem may even be worse than we know. Sometimes because there's so many emotions involved and so many other issues, they're less likely to get reported. Here are some ways to protect your child's identity. Be careful when sharing information with relatives. Consider freezing your child's credit report and keep your child's name off any public document, even something like a magazine subscription, any data that could be sold to a third party. Don't share your child's social security number with anyone unless absolutely necessary. And don't be afraid to ask why someone needs that information. It's up to parents to protect their children by asking questions. You can never ask too many questions. We have posted much more information about protecting your child's identity. You can find it all on the Help Me Hank page at clickondetroit.com. Just look under the consumer tab. Unfortunately, as we mentioned, this is a growing crime and, yeah. and children, I mean, how many times do you think about chi checking your child's no, you social don't. security you, you're number? You're probably checking your own credit card statements and watching it, but yes, not checking your child's name very often right. at all. So the FBI Surprising. is working to get ahead of it, but again, a lot of times the, the, the criminals are people that you may know, yeah. so That's that scary. makes it even more complicated. Yeah. Interesting.